a new take on homes in the D and it's turning heads. And you may think it's a greenhouse or an industrial building, but as photographer Alex Atwell shows us, what's inside is uniquely Detroit. Every single person, no matter what they look like, how much money they have, where they come from, they respond to it the same way. Where am I? What is this? And then they decide, this is cool. We are at 16th Street in Hancock, a quiet and peaceful neighborhood in Detroit, Michigan. And we're at a project called True North, which is a project I just developed and completed. It's nine livework residences using the Quonset Hut as the, the primary structure. Quonset Hut is a military structure. The U.S. Army originally devised them in Quonset, Rhode Island, and built them and sent them overseas to platoons to build quick shelter. So I figured a repurposed Quonset Hut would be a very cool way to live as well. I built one for myself, which I'm standing next to right here. People loved it so much, I built nine more across the street. So first and foremost, they attract people who think different to a neighborhood. A. And so people who think different are more accepting, naturally. That's one. Two, they are more affordable. So to build a Quonset Hut, it isn't that it's cheaper, it's that you can get a lot more inspired space for a lower price. And that was that's the real key. Is like I don't want to diminish the quality of space. Everybody's done affordable housing for forever. This isn't just affordable, it's also inspired. In most other cities you have new and old. And in Detroit, you also have new and old, but there's a more interesting opportunity, in my opinion, which is utopic and dystopic. Detroit was a utopia at one point in time. It was a real beacon. Every American aspired to send their dollars to Detroit for an American automobile, and it became a utopia in this country. And at the same time, it became a dystopia. Very few cities have the opportunity to tap into that sort of sensibility. And this project is both utopic and dystopic. This project, in my opinion, taps into the real creative opportunities that exist in Detroit. This is like living on a loft in the ground. So like it's just open space, it's all one big room. You really have to approach your life a little bit differently. You can't think about closet space. You become a minimalist of sorts, um, or you live with all your things. And so not only does this change the way people think about this neighborhood, it also changes the way people who live in these huts think about their lifestyle. It's a simple way of living, but it's inspired, so I like that. How cool is that? Very cool, and we thank Alex Atwell for his photographic talents behind Absolutely. the lens. Absolutely. I want to move into one of those now. Anyways, it may be.